Today we're going to have some tips on Wii Video editing. Yeah, the Wii Video editor is really a good one to start with if you're not familiar with any kind of editing. And, and even if you are, this is really a good one. I've had other ones cost a lot more and everything. And you can get this free to start with. And um, I just really like this one. And you can use your phone. You can go out somewhere and take a picture and upload it right there. So they're web-based, so it's not on a hard drive or nothing. But, you know, you can take your phone outdoors, take a picture of a, anything you want, a train going by, a video. You bring it back in or, or you send it to the cloud if you want. It better be on your media. Just look on your media. You got to get up here and tap on your media. It's right up here. And then it'll show up in here somewhere. And then say you want to look at it, you tap on this and it would bring it up. Say you want to bring this down here into a timeline. You just put it right here. There, it'd be right on your timeline. And that could be a you know video, anything you want. It just makes it real easy to make videos with. Yeah, you really can't uh, go wrong. If you try to drag anything where it ain't supposed to go, it won't go anyway. See how it turn? It'll go green there. It'll go in there with the sound. It's not a sound here or a video, so it won't work. Let go. It just goes back where it belongs. And um, and if you wanted to pick your music, you just go. You can go to audio, and we just got all kinds of sound effects. I'm I really ain't mess with sound effects a whole lot, but um, I looked through there, and free music, free, and you make a lot of videos of that. Some of them you have to turn down, turn up, whatever, and uh, it might not be the kind of music you'd you know, like all of them, but you're going to like some of them. You could also put in any kind of music you want down here. You know, you got wiped out for copyright laws. You can play other people's music, but unless it's free, and um, but you know, you play the guitar or something, you know, they could play something, you can put it in there, and um, the sound really helps the, the video, and okay, let's get on here, texting, I'll show you how I do this, we double click, first you go up here, let's go to, first you go up here to where it says text, you get on that, double click, see there's motion, static, whatever, motion's pretty nice, just go with the first one, where it says trailer here, but you put what you want up there. So if you drag this down, okay, it's down there. You double click on it. When it turns gold, you double click, and then it'll show you the scale. Um, what you well, first you can go up here and put what you want on text. I'll just put my name up here. You just print your name. Well, I gotta get on trailer here. Where it says trailer cut, you just it says the first one. It says trailer cut, and you go over here, click on that. And I'll just put my name on there. All right, um, and where it says cut, uh, you just write whatever you want. Well, I don't look right. Okay, um, then you got it. You can make it big or smaller. Let's say I want that my name bigger. I just put on man, hit manual once. And you keep clicking that little arrow there and make it big if you want. You yeah. anyway, when you have a color up here, you know, you can make it red. Um, um, you can make the bottom red or just top, whatever you want here. And, and anyway, you uh, got to hit. Always have to hit save changes if that's what you want. We're not going to say. Well, I'll go ahead and drag it down just to show you how it works. And uh, we'll get it over here like so. Come on, get it over here. All right, we made made it too big, but it's all right. You can scatter them out. I don't know if you notice how I did that. You can move anything around you want. But anyway, um, okay, now see where it says that's your text. It can be your intro, your in, outro, whatever you want. Now, see, it'll show over your video if you want it to, over the sound and everything. But we don't really uh, want that right there. I'll show you how we would split that up. Probably already showed you that, but you could take this and split it up with that. Or you can just delete it if you want. And anything you do would get rid of it. But you can straight. You can also get a hold of the edge, drag these things out as long as you want them, and they go all through the clips. But we're gonna just get rid of this one. All you have to do is 
If it's gold, just hit delete. And this one here, I don't even remember what it was, but we're going to get rid of it too. Just once it's gold, we delete it. And um, that's it on a text. The text is real easy. Yeah, the transitions are right up here. Can't miss it. Uh, they come in handy. Eh? So I just don't, I don't use them a lot, but a lot of people like them and don't make it look so blocky when it trans from one to the other. You just things. But it's, and you just drag them down there too with one on there. I don't use them a lot. If you do use them, I think the top two is best, but there's a really good one down there lower. Again, you remember the text, and, and uh, say you, if you're done with this video, you just hit, you just reach up here and hit finish, and it would lead you. You can save your video, you can upload it, and it'll let you know when it's done. Then you can put it on YouTube or about anything you want it. And uh, okay, we go to backgrounds. They're right here. I mean, you got everything you want. Backgrounds, and some of them's pretty nice. I go to say overlays. That way, it don't cover it up. See how you got that dragon up there? I don't like it. Let's go to frames. Let's go to frames. I want them lips on there. Um, there you go. Look at that. And if you put that, if you would put that right here, and look what would happen. Uh, bam! It covers that up. And then, uh, you know, not what you'd want to use right here, but it's uh, there's a place for it. And, all kinds of them. You got overlays, a frame, you know, backgrounds. You can make it look like snow or rain, something like this. You know, not just all kinds of blue sky. And if you want to turn it up or down, see, I think I already told, said this, but a little blue line. So you can move that up or down any way you want it. Click on it, move it up or down. And it can get louder as it goes along. Come in high and go low or vice versa. Or you can double click on them and um, go and turn it down low if you want. I got a place over here. There's several ways of doing that. There's all kinds of things you'll learn as you go along and then you'll get better and better and learn different things on here and be able to make really nice videos. Thanks for listening.